Bemidji State University canceled all classes today after an incident involving racist threats on social media. Administration is currently working alongside the Bemidji Police Department and has increased its public safety presence since last night. Reporter Justin Othout has more on the story. Last night, Bemidji State University's Center for Diversity, Equity and Inclusion sponsored a Beaver Huddle event in Hagsauer Hall. The event was meant to discuss hate-based incidents that had been recently occurring on BSU's campus. We had uh, an incident that occurred in our residence halls, uh, a racial incident that occurred in our residence halls. One of the targets of these incidents reached out to Lakeland News to discuss her experience. To keep her identity hidden, we've refrained from using any images and have altered her voice. We discovered the N-word was carved into my door. Um, along with just some random like scratches and marks that had been on there. As we often do, we, we convened a beaver huddle. Uh, this is one of the tools that we use to bring students together uh, to talk, to listen, to share their ideas, their concerns, their questions, uh, etc. While the event was initially meant to serve as a way to confront difficult topics of racial and social justice, it soon took a dark turn later in the evening when comments were made on an anonymous messaging board known as Yik Yak. And we saw hate in its truest forms after that meeting um, with some social media postings. There's people um, threatening to commit more hate crimes against people of color. There was also a comment that was pertaining to my friends and I, and it read, the girls in the front row need to be skinned. As a result of these threats, it was decided by administration to cancel all classes on Friday, March 3rd, and to heighten security on campus. Around midnight, they sent out email that classes were canceled. Uh, and we worked through some options spoke with the Bemidji Police Department, spoke also with our campus security and uh, determined that uh, the appropriate action for us would be to cancel classes. Although classes weren't in session today, staff did meet to address this incident and a student conference was also held to discuss these events. As an institution, as a, as a people, as human beings, we don't want to see that on our campus. Like that's just not okay. I just don't want this to happen to anyone else. Because realistically and honestly, this has been one of the hardest weeks of my life. I want BSU to say enough is enough. Reporting in Bemidji, I'm Justin Othout, Lakeland News. President Hoffman says an investigation is underway in hopes of identifying the individual or ind individuals making these threats and says this behavior will not be tolerated. Lakeland News is member-supported content. Please consider supporting Lakeland News today.